Having it quite open and interactive. We've decorated a dragonfly and we've just listened to Winnie the Witch. To have a free event just like this, you can just wander in and it just happens to be on, and there's a real witch here telling stories, it's just brilliant. It's a good day, good life. I like to read um, factual books, um, historical factual books is my, really, is my sweet spot. I love autobiographies and just seeing different people's like lifestyles and you know it's not always as glam and good as you think or how it is made out to be. When you're writing and how you're feeling about the writing you're either immersed in it and having a good time or you're terrified right? Biden at least will put his arm around his allies and try to cajole people and but it's still America first. It, it always is. Every single American president is America first. They're just not rude enough to say so. Because it is rude. The power of geography. I've just come from a talk by Tim Marshall. Um, and that is like a fantastic book. It's so interesting um, and it's really powerful. And I don't usually read books that aren't novels. What makes novels wonderful is, as what St Alban said, it's the enlargement of sympathy. It's the way you start to understand people that you wouldn't otherwise understand or start to, you know, you can imagine lives that you wouldn't necessarily come to contact with. When you are in the public eye, everybody is just scrutinising every single inch of you, you know, you know, how you look, your hair, how you eat a bacon sandwich, like everything, basically. Yeah. You're so paranoid. That's why Boris Johnson is quite a remarkable character, because he does seem to, like, just genuinely not care. boy, obviously I wanted to be Prime Minister. Ah, and there may be some people here this evening who rather wish that I was Prime Minister. I also, quite quickly after that, thought I'd be an actor. And I played the role of Hamlet. And it wasn't very good. The audience threw eggs at me. I, I came on as Hamlet, went off as omelette.